it's time to do this joke for the for the for the, the, the seventh time. Okay. I'm here to get something off my mind, a little uh, rant to say. No matter if you're a writer, musician, artist, content creator, or something else, most likely the fake fan epidemic has surfaced around your name, at least if you're mildly popular. The fake fan epidemic is where a fandom splits himself apart because of an unnecessary clarification as to what a real fan is. I'm going to use music artists and content creators as a primary example of what I'm talking about. So, what is a fake fan? By Urban Dictionary's definition, a fake fan is one who is, well, a fresh consumer of a certain someone that makes content, or someone who isn't too familiar with them and knows a few of their most popular songs. So, what is a fan? A person who has interest or likes something or somebody. Basically, anybody that likes something. Do you see how these are contradictory so far? Let me continue. So, here's to ask. Why does it matter? Well, the answer is it, uh, it doesn't. Let's look at X, a Florida rapper who was shot and killed in June last year. When he was nowhere near as popular, he had a much smaller loyal fan base. But now after his death and his popularity being almost four times as big as it was in mid-2017, in older songs there are thousands of comments about fans saying, Fake fans will not find this here. And much more people going off about the same thing, just because it's his older content. Like, the same thing can go with other musicians, but this is just the person I found that has the biggest problem in this area. I don't know why I'm making a serious video on this, but l let me ask. With the thousands of comments I see about this shit on the daily, why does it matter? Tell me why it matters if someone only knows the mainstream songs. They'll still be supporting the artist that you clearly hold so dear to your heart, and one does not need to know everything about someone's personal life to be a fan of them. Let me tell you something. If this epidemic ever started around my name, which if I continue to get bigger it will surface around my name, I would hate for that to happen. Because I, I don't like my old content. It's boring. It had it had more personality, I'm not gonna lie, it had personality, you could see the personality. The effort wasn't there. Hey guys, it should be 2018 by the time you're watching this, so happy new years I guess. Today I'm gonna talk about something I deal with on the daily- So, I, I, I came to realization mid-editing that my voice has changed a lot. I sounded like a woman. So, that's funny, uh, back to the video. It was kind of bland. There wasn't much editing. There wasn't much to it. So if you had to have some clarification of seeing my old shit to be an actual like real fan of Wolficide, I would I would despise that. And I assume a lot of artists tend to grow and improve from their older stuff and their older content. So I highly doubt that they would like other people. You know, everyone in the mainstream knowing everything they've done, depending on who it is. Because myself, I dislike a lot of the old stuff I did. More of the videos I'm proud of are the ones that were made in like October and after. Even though I haven't made much in like that time span, that's how it is for me. So there is no such thing as a fake fan to a content creator or anyone in particular. Yes, the story is different if you claim to be a number one fan of someone or something or, you know, like a poser. But not knowing someone's old content or music or not knowing a bunch about the artist's personal life doesn't make you a fake fan or not validate supporter of them. That case should only apply if they claim that they have knowledge as such. Stop this fake fan epidemic, dude. If someone likes someone's music and supports them, they're a fan. Having some type of clarification to confirm if someone's a real fan or not is retarded. It's unnecessary and plain stupid. Let people support things. Don't have a fandom divided because they only know an artist or creator's most recent pop and stuff. I, I think I got my point across. Fake fan, you know, clarification status should really only be relevant in the process if it's someone who is a poser or is someone who claims to know such. If they don't claim or pretend to know everything about an artist, they're still a valid supporter if they only know their mainstream stuff. So that's what I got to say. I got my point across. Please stop doing this. Please stop the fake fan epidemic. Thank you. Good night. Hey, you a fun nigga. What? I might taste some. Okay. Stick your fingers like I'm made up out of tape or some. <laughs> Invite members only. Ooh. We might break some. Fuck and serve your daughter dirty water like hey. they make it some. Uh, sipping out of up, no cup. Long clip like a bitch, back, no butt. Sipping out of up.